Uh, say I've been the Coast Guard Cyber Command, the CIO, for uh, the last four years, and the amount of collaboration, particularly within government, uh, has just escalated at a rapid rate. It's still not where it needs to be. I have a un unique viewpoint being a DHS component and working uh, in that realm, but also being a DOD component under the U.S. Cyber sure. Command. Uh, just even trying to watch that information exchange across uh, those two right. entities. Actually, you're sharing yourself with, your, your, with, your, with yourself. You yeah, know? and it's interesting, but it has. It's, it's really improved um, over the last couple of years where we're actually having those dialogues. And then the next piece, again, because I'm a, uh, a sector-specific agency for maritime critical infrastructure, watching the department start to uh, Homeland Security move to push that information out to those lower levels um, in the state mm -hmm. uh, local environments um, has rapidly escalated. It's nowhere w where it needs to be because you have to build those uh, capabilities to do it, one, to share at the higher classification levels, and then to figure out how to take the information and bring it down into a more easily distributed. And then it's with industry. Um, there has been numerous industry partnerships that have been established to share these threat informations and get them out there, as he said, in real time. It's almost like we need that constant CNN news feed that everybody can tap into at various different channels where you can draw the information that you need for your sector. So uh, um, I think there's been improvements, uh, but there is still need for uh, uh, greater efforts in this area. Right.